All right. I'm going to try this out and see if it's going to go well or not because lately it hasn't been going well. I'm not going to lie. And it's just been a bit annoying. I went from being able to do it to not being able to do it. So, I don't know. Duality, baby! We're going to use a uh, Paragat Gauntlet. This is the build. Burning Mole. Healing Grenade. Throwing Hanuma. Soul Invictus. Roaring Flames. or Aspects. Then Nimble Torches. Ash Searing and Imperium. We're going to run with Callus Mini 2. We might switch it up. And we might use the Wastelander with 1-2 Punch. And we might switch it up to um, Scatter Signal or Riptide. We also have these as our mods. Worst comes to worst, if I feel like it's dangerous, I'm going to switch one of these out um, to recuperation. Um, but we'll see how we go. Um, and we got two solo and one arc. Two solo, one arc. I'm rocking a sniper for traversal. I chose Whisper because why not? Um, yeah. You want to play? Yay! You did what? Nah, um... So we'll see. We'll see how we go! Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna concentrate on trying to finish it. And if I have any tips, I'll let you know. She told me, leave me alone. I've been having a lot of issues with Lament lately. Um, it is what it is. Now, here's the first, um, first tip. See this little circle? See the bells in the middle? Make sure you're in the circle. Make sure your feet are planted in the circle. Sometimes it um, can get a bit lost. Just going to grab that. And we're just going to make our way up. Wee, wee. We're going to jump up and around. And I just like to jump up here, then jump up here. It's mirrored. It's mirrored on the other side to jump up here, then jump up there. And this is mirrored too. So either side you can do it in. So like I could turn around and jump up, but it's just for momentum's sake, I'm just going to jump up here. Now, the bell that you need to shoot is right up here, and sometimes that can be hard. So I like to shoot this one because it's just a little bit easier. I miss the days where the hammer was infinite. <sighs> I miss the days when. Ooh, that reminds me. Alright, we're gonna walk outside, do a full 360, and shoot that bell behind us. Before we go up in flames. The bell is actually on the other realm around there. But then we're gonna, you know, we're spawning like this on our right side down here. That's where we need to be. So I'm just gonna jump to this platform. If it was our hunter, it'll be a different story. And I'm gonna try to think less and just try and do and relax. Sometimes there's a guy here. Today he is here. Gotta watch out for that explosion. Thank you, baby. The last time I did duality solo of Lawless, it was once and I was with the hunter. And I was hyperventilating. I don't know y'all know what that means, but I was like <laughs> trying to figure it out. And you know, you know, three eyes is like at the end. Breathe. Baby breathe. And I'm sitting there like, you don't understand, free eyes. I just did this all out. Wee. Oh. See, I think Whisper should finish that. 
Better grab that before it disappears. We're just gonna kill everything in here. What's with the teleporting enemies? Wow. Right, once all the enemies are dead. Maybe you know that that is a soldier. We're gonna switch to lament. Stick with everything. You wanna do the rip tide? I don't wanna do I'm gonna do the rip mm. Wastelander first. If worst comes to worst, I'll do the rip tide. But we're good. Changing to a solo reverse reserve chest plate. And let's go. That's all right. Now the bells, the bell keepers, which will activate the bell, is on the opposite side. Always remember that. It's a part of the mechanic of this dungeon that will be useful. Now we're going to look at the rooms to see if there are any dogs in them. And then we're going to kill this beautiful scion. Alright, we're going to pick up the SNC drops. I just want restoration. And then we're going to go see what other... Oh, you know what? I got the wrong aspect on. Uh, well, might as well use it. And we're not gonna. We're not gonna pick up that essence. I just came back from. Um, what's his name? I just came back from. Cool. I just came back from onslaught. So we're just going to sit here until I get my hammer back. At least my hammer. I should still have um, restoration. No, it's fine. There we go. My hammer's back. All right. What do we got? We got war beast. That's the bottom. We. Thanks. The reason for it is a bit difficult sometimes. Um, any mini money more, Rex doesn't know what to say anymore. We just gonna. I don't didn't need to do that. We on a rampage. Let's go. I want to try this one. Hmm. Maybe not. I don't know. Hey, bro. So we're just going to kill these guys. These guys drop a, a little red orb that I pick up. Unstable light. Essence, sorry. That's what's helping me kill them all with one shot. Alright. I'm gonna come down here. We're gonna go bam. I'm gonna go pick up the next one. Do not kill the scion the second time you come through. Since I have all these beautiful restoration builds, um, I gotta be careful. And we're gonna go straight to the bell. Now it's important to see that nightmare collapse collapsing on the bottom left of my screen. If that hits zero, we're dead. And since this is we're the only ones here, baby, it wipes us completely. All right, now we got chalice's top. I'm gonna get my super before I do this. I'm gonna get my super before I do this. Watch this. We. Um. I will switch over to um, the Riptide. Thanks. You don't have to kill these guys. I just like to. Shoot the bell. 
Let's go, baby. Sion, always make sure he's dead. Um, he sometimes will be in the same area. He sometimes won't be in the same area. And as you can see, I have a higher time frame than what I normally would. That's because I killed the Sion, but I'm pretty late. I should have been moving. Let's go to the boss. Need to make sure the boss gets in the fire. We're gonna wait till um, ten seconds, and then we're gonna go get the bell. If you do this correctly, you should have about um, halfway. But I didn't do this correctly because he keeps jumping at me. I gotta make sure I wait. Okay, ten, uh, uh, seconds. Right. Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo. Close. So that wasn't the best damage phase. Nevertheless, it is a damage phase. Yeah, I will be full anyway, it doesn't matter. Rolling flames times two. Alright. I'm looking at my map, which you guys can't see. There's nothing on my left or my right. Just give me some restoration, please. Oof. Alright, it's up top here. Again, I'm going to kill both of them. That is right. Chalice? Alright. Take me where the angels are and let me die in peace. Still gotta go through, so I'm cool. Thank you, homie. Gonna pick up that orb. Ah, time. Make it up to the right. Get some restoration. The hammer used to be stronger than that, baby. Don't kill anyone here. Watch out for boss. He can boop you off. We don't want that happening. He can make you go up, and then I will kill you too. Thank you, Bungie. Ooh, Wobbies, let's go. I'm also full of heavy, so... I'm gonna drop another one. I don't know. But I'm not full on special. So I'm just gonna stay in farm. Speak of the devil! Yeah, it's okay. They'll always be here. I don't have to feel. Angels are in me dying peace. We oh.
since there will be damage, I'm not going in there until I have special ammo. Like that. Now I'll go in there. Sion. Oh god. I don't know where the boss is. Found him! Seven, two, three, four. One, two, three. I don't think I'll make this one, so we're gonna do another phase. Yeah, we're gonna do another phase. All right, that sucks, but okay. The end of it. Hmm. <sighs> It's the end. The end of... This one we won't be bothered with the sign and stuff. It's the end of Paragel Gauntlet. The far end of it. That's the reason. <sighs> That's fair enough. It's good to know. <laughs> now we're gonna keep doing the same thing. I can't shoot that bell, but I'm alright. Idol, right? hmm. I I have like that's what I was trying to say like when I did try this I um I did end up flawlessing it I mean swallowing it and it was fine and easy Nice. I guess more time won't hurt, you know. You hardly get time. Nah, wait till you kill everything. Because things do explode when you open that door. And um, the big guy does shoot rockets at you. He's like coded to. Um... So it's better off to open that door when you don't have many things going on. Um, like that. I'm gonna keep that rolling buff up. Grab dog and leave. So I gotta find a way to. It's not about hitting him with power girls, it's about hitting him with the end of power girls. Hmm. Unfortunate. 
just trying to get more try to get more ammo I guess not heavy just um, for my other one because you don't want to run out of it um, getting those things yep where are the other guys you coming yet there you are he said do you have any um we and even though it is tedious here to farm especially like once those cabal guys go the only guys you get are um the scions and there's only like four i think of them i really want more there we go what yeah i'll do sort of do make our way here yeah something like that Since we're going to the second boss, I'm just going to switch straight away to this. Give me that. Okay. And this build is just simple. It says same thing, but it's got a recuperation, two solar weapons, and it's got burning hammer soul instead of burning wall. Um, it also switches. I shouldn't have probably done it, but it's okay. No stress, you're stressed. Here, there's a little rail um, up top here. See this rail? You want to jump on it and you want to go here. And be careful, you can die a lot, so practice this. And we're going to open this. I'm just going to open these little green doors. Now, the best way, just take your time. The best way to do it is to uh, undershoot these you'll find it a bit better and then when you jump down here you want to jump just before the end here because that won't kill you you can fall down there and die oh I don't have it run 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 I didn't have it I'm only doing this because scorch damage will give me my hammer back and that's really important and I can always use it I just wanted to get my hammer. You can't run through all this, but I just wanted to make sure my hammer was with me, baby. No. Don't leave me. I want you here with it. Just jump here. Don't double jump. Don't activate your thruster because you hit the roof, you're screwed. All right. Careful with hunters. Maybe use a sword. Wee. I screwed this up so many times. So many times I don't remember, but anyway, just so you know, if you jump to oh. so this is the one that we walked that we came through. If you come to this section, normally I said to you when doing a flawless run, never ever do secret chests, but do all these dungeon secret chests are actually super easy to get, and there's no danger to them whatsoever. So here's one of them. It's left when you enter. <sighs> um, you can see, I don't. This might take a while. This might take so long. Um, that's one. That's two. Two.
So you're just twisting them in the other realm. That's it. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. I always screw this up somehow. So worst comes to worst, I'll cut the video. If it takes too long, I'll cut the video into when we're ready. I oh, we screwed up. And this is just one. I think that's two. Whee! And I think that's the sound saying it's complete. Yep. Uh, it didn't take long. Cool. And then it's up to the second boss fight. I'm not going to use power girls for this because if I'm in a pinch, I need to just get my things out so far. I'm going to just use Wastelander and the limit. Same things. It's just hammer saw. You can use power girls if you want to. It doesn't matter. But the tip that I have here, let me just get to this and get to the flag. It's super simple. You want to have radiancy on all your weapons if you can. The reason for that is because when the cabal, there's going to be a bunch of places where there's going to be cabals with shields. Radiancy just helps you kill them a lot quicker because the quicker you kill them and then kill the big boy, the quicker you'll get the essence. The quicker you get the essence, the quicker you can get back in here. So it's really, really important to think of it that way. Also, um, yeah. All right, let's start. Those are my biggest tips. There's four set. There's two sets of bell keepers to fall together for each bell. And remember the whole. Um, remember the whole. Um, uh, where the bell keepers will spawn in the other realm in the opposite direct opposite opposite place of. Um, Yep, of where you shot the bell. So if I shot that bell, the bell keepers will be on this side. So super easy to remember. Like I said, it's one of the main mechanics is dungeon, and I highly recommend just practicing it for a bit before proceeding because it's well, you'll see why it's coming in handy. So let's see how I do it. Axe and sun. I have no idea what that was. I forgot it. Take my time. I have resilience. Sun is here, and the other one's not axe. Right. Da, 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 da. Yep, okay, so sun is on my So sun is here and bell keepers are gonna be here because I'm gonna shoot this bell. Now sun's on my right, so I'm gonna to jump to the left side here. And the bell will always be here, bell keepers will always be on this bowling platform. So that's how I do it. I do it where I'm on a specific side. Right? That's one guy with shield. There's a specific amount of... Everything has barrier. Okay. We have a time limit too. When we kill the standard barrel, we'll be okay. We'll spawn now. Just gotta kill specific enemies and that's the Grab it and run. Run for your life. We don't have much time actually. That's why when doing this with others is a bit easier, but when doing it by yourself, it's like, eh, just gotta do one at a time and just take your time. And then go in the bell, shoot the bell. Uh, you might see that I always shoot above it in the middle of the bell. I don't shoot um on the other side, that is because if I do shoot on the bottom of the bell, or um, it might count as two shots instead of one, and if you're in a sticky situation, like you're counting down and you want to go, it's like life and death. When it hits zero, if you shoot it, it's, you're screwed. So it's not after zero like a lot of other things. So there's a lot of things like um, you can clutch it with some other dungeons and stuff, for example, Warlords. But once yeah, when the boss, uh, when when the fa uh, when the boss phase goes to zero, then when the counter goes to zero, then it's boss damage. Um, it's not before. 
It's not after when he hits zero, it's after zero. It's like an extra second. Ah, so again, just for sake, so that's axe, right? That's what I think we need. Alright, so axe. I'm gonna shoot axes on my right when I turn around, so be careful to stand in the middle. So over here, I'm gonna kill these guys. Make sure you see how I'm on my left, and when I turn around, I'm I'm ready here. So this is the first bell keeper, the other bell keeper, and I just go up. Um, if you practice stuff like that, it becomes a little bit easier to um, to hand, to like just remember and handle. Like it's a safety mechanism. You'll know that you got the wrong essence because your timer, your nightmare collapsing, will go from 30 seconds or 20 seconds, whatever it's on, to about zero. Now the the bell, another tip is, it's easy to see what the bell is because there's a dark red aura around it. And you start killing monsters, get more ammo. Cool. Now I'm just gonna make sure I proc restoration. Nice. And the bell keepers have spawned, but we're gonna ignore the bell keepers. We're not gonna bother touching them. We'll touch them after. Just about being safe and sorry. And no, I will not be using my super. And this guy is just strictly the map. Nice little soft ground. I can get my combos done properly. There is a lot of arc damage. Um, here. So now that he's down, we just go do our bell keepers like normal. And be careful, these guys do explode, so really be careful not being too close to them. And if you're going to use your weapon, that's why I'm trying to use a weapon that's going to one shot them. Um, or incinerate them like my hammer does. I'll show you here. Oh, so the boss can do that. So see how he just dies instantly? If I shoot him. See that explosion? That second explosion? That first one was incandescent. Um, that second explosion is just going to wreck you. Alright, so now the bell keepers are down. We got dog and cup. And just do it again. Sometimes you'll get them on the same side. So in that case, you just want to make sure you're prepared. Um, and just talk to yourself consistently. Ah, I said dog and cup, eh? No one, there's no, I killed everyone. I killed everyone, baby. So dog is here. I think I think cup is on the other side, but I'm just gonna check over here. You, there are maps for this too. If I can find it, I remember I will um, let you know. I'm just gonna nice. Make sure my rolling flames is up, and yep. Since I'm here anyway, dog is here. Cool. So when I turn around, it'll be on my left. Always make sure you have him on. Alright, I'll be on my left. So I'm on my, I'm on the, yep, see I'm on this side. And yeah, that's the staircase, not this one, the other staircase. So that's how I do it. Hopefully that helps. I'm going to be quiet now and hope that I can, who's going to explode? Hope that I can, um, yep. And if you want to use your super, you can just like right here, you pop it. It, it gives me anxiety knowing that I, um, just gives me anxiety, right? Yep, again, the big red aura. It's a bit more red than the actual area. Don't tempt fate. Take your time. We gotta kill, do this two more, one more time after this, so, yeah, get familiar with it.
I don't know why I do that. I'm just going to do stuff like this. Where are you? Alright, let's go find out the other place. We'll die. What's this? Cup? Is that the one that we need? Oh, I was lucky. Yep, that's the one we need. Cup is on my, on my left when I turn around. Easy. As you can see, I'm going to go left. Roaring flames, roaring flames, roaring flames. I get, I get radiancy whenever I get a hammer kill. So we're sorted. So yeah, you just pop your super. So that's what I meant. You can just use your super. Sorry, in front of us. That sniper's hit hard, man, I'm telling you. It will, it can be the death of you. Up. So yeah, so if I shoot this part or the top part, I might not. Okay, thank you. And not obviously just kill the monsters. I'm gonna try to get restoration up. The bell keeper should stay in the area. They shouldn't, um, you know, have to move. And we just wait. Yep. Bruh. I still have restoration, so anything. That comes in my way will help me proc restoration. I got bored. <laughs> Alright, we'll do it one more time. Alright. Should I have a Roaring Flames buff? So. Because the Roaring Flames times three helps me with, um. What's her name? I don't know. Helps me with the bell keepers. Oh. You can explode over there, I don't need you. Yeah, just trying to not hit him at the back. So we got axe and dog. Uh, and I lost my hammer. My hammer would have probably died here. So to get my hammer back, I just need restoration. And the best way to get that is by scorch damage. There you go. There is um a mod one two finisher. Ah, dog and axe, right? Yep. One two finisher will um will uh help a lot. Dog and axe. Yeah, so dog and axe are the same. So that's pretty cool. That's good to know. We're gonna. Yep, dog and axe is the same. It's in opposite direction. Just double check. I'm gonna double check. I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die here, baby. Dog. Homie, have a hammer to the face. Oh man, you just pawned. You just wanted. Just wanted a punch, eh? So they're on this side. And this is where you just gotta think a bit. And it's a bit hard to think when you have so many things going on around you. So, if I shoot this, they're gonna be there. So, I'm just gonna shoot this. Alright, I'm gonna kill these. Alright, I'm gonna go for a walk. And I might pop my super here. Look at that, they're all in that little spot. Hmm. 
Okay. Pick up this and let's go. There's no way I'm going to be able to go to the other side, get that build. That's why we just do it one by one. Let me get that thing. So the good news is that I did the hard thing first. And now when I shoot that bell, it's going to be one of these sections. So I can just do things normally. Yep. And the other thing that sucks is the third encounter, Kaido. Hopefully we get to her. Um, let me pick up my hammer. Punch. 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 And I got my hammer back. This gives me rolling flames, but it doesn't give me... um. I need to do a build video. Like, screw it. Why wait for people? Just get a build video going. Alright, baby. So, it's going to be on this side. There it is. So, it's going to be on my left when I turn around. Which is fine. Alright. Don't aim up. Thanks. Let's run, baby, run. If I had my super, maybe. Ooh, always make sure you reload. Nah. I don't have my super, so we're just going to wait. There can be a lot of, um, no, if I switch my super now, there can be a lot of, uh, not hesitation, but more like, um, <sighs> right, excuse me, I'm trying to dunk the essence. Now, I've noticed that the boss on the third phase tends to hang about in the corners. Um, a bit more. So you just gotta be careful not to be booped off. Nah, I'm gonna save my super in case I need it. Lament is going to be um, nerf next season. So you just gotta be careful. Alright, we're gonna switch over to this guy and because we're going to try this now, and you can use a scout, you can use whatever you want, you can use snipers, you can do, honestly, whatever you want. I just rather it be quick and it's a one shot. So let's jump down, grab the chest. Ooh. Damn. Beautiful smile. Wish you live, be lost. Oh, she will be loved, my bad. I gotta get the secrets of this place, man. Whee! Now, next secret is just, if you come over here and you just go underneath here, the next secret chest is just right in here. So I say it's super easy. And if you haven't got it already, there's a secret here as well, a secret message. Anyway. Three sixty no scope. And we're just gonna run to the right here and we're just gonna jump. Try to land up here. Land above here. And then in this room right here. Okay. Think about Kaido. Uh, mm. 
Okay. Got the ladder up, turn around, go up. Turn around, shoot the bell. All the way straight, shoot the other one. Don't shoot it while you're in here, because you will die. <laughs> Homie. And then up. Now, if you jump all the way, this thing is going to hit you and push you down. So just jump off the ledge. Alright. Yeah, I was afraid that was going to happen. It's okay. Fun fact, that's the last place for the uh, catalyst. It's a nice little soldier to get there. And then we're going to jump down and it's scary. So again, just for the sake of it, we're just going to jump at the end of it. Take your time with these jumps. We're not going to need this anymore. Please take your time with these jumps. It's just up here. Then up here. Up to the right again. Just up here. And then up here. And then you want to make it that one. You can make it. Uh, but just as you know, and then up here. Nice. Just so you know, I'm um, not good at this, and we need to go power kills again. So I'm just going to go to Burning Mall, run power kills, come back here, because I have to set up this to have a bit more better. I've done, I did that whole thing. Without Solomon's on? Pardon me, we're gonna go Riptide. Oh, 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 oh. Bang Mole. Fire Girls. Wait. What's this for? Oh. So the resist mods on, and we're just gonna go down. We're not gonna jump because it's gonna start. We want to land down here. Ooh. Ooh. All right, you ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Take your time. It's times like this where you really need to take your time. It's gonna blow up. A lot of snipers, a lot of damage, a lot of things going on. You scared? Don't be scared. We're safe. This build is safe. We just need to make sure they don't blow up completely. <laughs> Sorry. Again, the bell keepers will be on the other. There's two sets of. There's three bells, so. Two, four, six spell keepers. And then in the other realm, there'll always be two. Unless the final boss f boss phase, then there'll be more than, there'll be three sets. So in the, right? So that really makes sense. There's two, one, one bell there, one bell there, and another bell there. And in the final countdown, in the final phase, so obviously I'm going to shoot one of these bells and then there'll be two bell keepers and the final phase there'll be three. So you just got to be careful. You're not going to pick me up. All right, we're okay. What do we got? Sun. And dog. So sun is there. What's that? Dog. So they're on the same side. So what I'm going to do is just shoot this one. Okay. And my aim is to get... the bell keepers as fast as possible and then they're on this side sweet it's important to make sure you know that what side they're on because sometimes they can be on the same side just like this and sometimes they can be on um, uh, on opposite sides so facing each other or on opposite sides so diagonal with each other All right, sweet. So now we're gonna dunk, and when we dunk, it's important to know that a crap ton of monsters are coming out. Like, so much. 
Like Kaido just went, oh, you wanna. You know? So, Tank One, you see what I mean. Look, see? Oh, but Rex, that's not enough. You said a crap ton. Oh, I know. My hammer! There's not many things that make me flinch in this game. So losing my ham ham is one of them. Watch out for explosions, Rex, mad dog. Alright, let's go dunk the other one. And then, Bell, no, Bell Keepers won't spawn until you do this two phases. Um, so if you screw up and then you shoot the second bell, and you, let's say you screwed up one of those phases and you shoot the second bell, yeah, the Bell Keepers will spawn. And you can't just screw up the rotations, but that's okay. Punch? Don't blow. I'm sorry. Sun? Oh, my leg's getting tired. Sun and dog. Alright, so that's Axe. Sun's up there. I think it's the same. Yep. Sun and dog are on the same side. So I'm going to shoot that again. Turn over here to kill these bell keepers. Again. As you can tell, so they're on the same side. I'm making sure... Same side, same side. I'm making sure the last place I go is the place I need to be. Uh, Alright, ammo time! I'm so scared. It's okay if you don't get the phase. It's okay if you don't get the phase. You'll know why in a minute. It's okay if you don't get the phase. Just gonna clear some of these snipers out. And hopefully by the time I uh oh yeah, those by the time um I'm not gonna dunk this just yet. I wanna make sure I have at least my healing grenade. Alright. Dunk. Then I'm gonna shoot these. Okay. And then in the middle, right here, this is where you want to be. Want to watch Kaido? She's coming to the front. So this is where I'm going to sacrifice this phase. So I'm going to shoot that, and I'm going to go kill the other. Yep. See where she's going. She's going this way. Once she gets up close, I'm gonna shoot this. And we're gonna go with damage. It's a short phase, see? Um, the reason why I'm doing damage is because I still have all my buffs. All right. She's going up here. So we're gonna go over here, we're gonna meet her here. And when she gets up the stairs to that black side, I'm going to shoot that. Let's keep doing damage. Once she's done like that, there's no point using more ammo on her. We're just going to come and kill the sniper. And it'll give us a little bit of restoration. I'm going to kill this one. That's going to keep our restoration on. I'm going to get ready with this. She's just mo she's walking away to that side, and then she disappears, and now we're back to business. Make sure you kill the bell keepers, and take your time here because they do explode. We want to make sure we also keep getting restoration and stuff. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just keeping myself safe. It's really important that we just relax. It was a really good face. Really good face. Just relax now.
No, I'll talk about it later. I'm gonna try and remember to talk about. Um... Oh no, I'm gonna punch you. To talk about that sign. Oh, sorry, son. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Sun and cap. Let's have a look around. So that's cup. Okay. And that's sun. Alright, we're gonna shoot the middle one. And it's gonna be opposite direction. So there's gonna be bell keepers here. It's on my right. Okay. I'm gonna grab that one. I don't have my hammer and I'm scared. But that's okay. I have. still have rolling flames. Again, if you get the wrong one, it just shoots you down to zero. And. I forgot about these bow keepers. And that's okay. Good job. Oh, that's opposite side, opposite side. So it's always good to remember, man. It's always good to remember. My ADHD brain doesn't remember all the time. Ah, oh, you forgot I had a hammer. Bro, I'll punch you. And you. You. Oh, he just disappears. I'm sick of it, Bungie. Why do they do that? You just like, if player comes to a thing, we're just going to shoot everything. Just kill it. Go on a f f rampage. Signing with you. And you. And you. And you. What do we got? We got X and you. X and Sun. X is there. Thank you, Kaido. And Sun. So they're on this facing each other. X and Sun are facing each other. X and Sun are facing each other. X and Sun are facing each other. And they're on my left. Okay. Okay, middle. Sorry, there is on my right. It's right here. Yep, and they're facing each other. See how it's important? It's important to read his object. Don't worry about that guy. Let's go to the bell. And make sure we have ammo. That's a good way. Oh. Did I just completely lose my hammer? I did. Sorry, I still have my healing grenade if I really wanted. If I needed it. And I was just proccing rolling flames. Not shooting the last one yet, again, because remember, a lot of things are going to spawn. And I'm not ready. A lot of things ready. Boom. Alright. Boom. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm running. <laughs> Where is she going? Forward again? Okay. Where are you going, baby? You going this way?
Okay. No. Oh, that's a lot better. Oh. Oh. Breathe, baby, breathe, breathe. You have Screw you, girl. You don't know how high that was. I shared your experiences and amongst so I don't want to dwell into his nightmares. His nightmares are just nightmare <laughs> I came to did it. Like I said, the first time I did it, I died second phase to to Kaido. I'm like, bruh, really? And the way I died was because something pushed me into the wall, which obviously made me one health, and hit me at the same time. And it's a misadventure. I'm like, bruh. So, woo, we did it, baby. We did it. Tips that I wanted to say during it that I completely forgot. Um, it's right on the top of my tongue. Really? No, it's not really. To be honest, that was, that was a lie. I'm sorry. There's a lot going on in Kaido's um, Kaido's boss phase. It's fine. It's like you just saw, I sacrificed one of them to go kill those things, and that really helped. It's all about. We're not wasting a lot of time and being efficient as possible. So you got to understand, you got to help yourself. You got to understand that when you turn around, your left is going to be on your left and <laughs> it's going to look like your right and stuff. So like right now I'm facing here, my right hand is here. Hey, but then when I turn around, my right hand is going to be that way. So it's good. So stuff like that. You got to remember, take your time on the jumps. I hope this helped. Thanks for, thanks for it. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. God bless. Peace and love.